I'm Adam Liatti, I'm the chef de cuisine at uh, Vetri Restaurant, and I'm here to show you a recent addition to our menu, the tortellini pie. These pies are traditionally served in Bologna. They're cooked in a communal oven, and each pie was captured with a, a little design so the owner could recognize that it was theirs. And an homage to Emilia Romagna, we made it the super Bolognese tortellini pie. Pat, our expert pie handler, is going to kind of take us through so this is the dough. No flour is used on the board because it's going to be able to stretch without it. Polpatini meatballs, they're classic meatballs. Uh, all three meats, uh, pork, veal, beef. These are the tortellini, uh, made in the traditional shape. Mortadella mousse is inside. Ragu bolognese. Now this is gently warmed right before we're using it. And that's going to let it melt over the ingredients and fill all those gaps. There's about a half uh, inch of uh, empty space on top, and that's going to be where bechamela will be filled. Its soft consistency is almost like cheese, even though there's no cheese inside. It's only milk, salt, butter, flour. Now for the top, a little reserved piece of dough. This dough was designed to cook quickly. The meatballs only reach an internal temperature of 135 degrees. I want these to be the, the juiciest meatballs around. 22 minutes later, our pie is baked, it's golden brown and ready to be served. Show it in the dining room, bring it back in the kitchen, slice it and serve it with 25 year old Belay balsamic vinegar from Modena. With such a savory pie, layers of, you know, small meatballs, ragu bolognese and bechamel, it's nice to have something sweet and delicate to, to finish the pie. And this balsamic really fits the bill. After the hard work of Pat, uh, we get to come to the really fun part where we get to eat the tortellini pie. Bon appetito. You can see all the layers of tortellini and bechamel and uh, it's, just, it's just kind of a nice reminder. Imagine what something like this came from. From all those pies that families would fill with their leftovers. You can kind of taste the, the meatball, you can taste the bechamel, you can taste the bolognese. you think they would all become one but they're still separate. And the balsamic really brings it together, kind of lightens it all up.